very, very quiet. I'm hunting rabbits. <laughs> I am a duck, bent on self-preservation. Say your prayers, wabbit. It's wabbit season. Duck season. Wabbit season. Duck season. Wabbit season. Wabbit season. Duck season. Fire! Fire! Everything. Daffy gets blasted. Mm -hmm. Page seven. Daffy gets blasted. Uh huh. Page eight. Daffy gets blasted again. What's the matter with you people? We can't do this kind of stuff anymore. A brother's warner. Showbiz legends like me shouldn't have to play stooge to that long-eared, carrot chomping, overbite challenge. Hey. What's up, Doc? <gasps> <gasps> hey, Bobby. How's the wife? Great nose job, Chuck. Oh, thanks, Coils. Good rug mail, never would have guessed. <laughs> Pardon me, the pleasure is mine. Fellas, I think that's right. Maybe I'll take a vacation. Go visit my 542 nieces and nephews. Mr. Duck, excuse me, I'm sorry. I don't see how we can have a Bugs Bunny movie without Bugs Bunny. Oh my heavens, no. You couldn't have a movie without Bugs Bunny. And if you don't mind me asking, whose glorified personal assistant are you? Kate Houghton, Vice President, Comedy. Right. Kate did lethal weapon babies. Finally, a lethal weapon that I can take my grandchildren to. Um, gentlemen, check your phones. Our latest research shows that Bugs Bunny is a core asset that appeals to male and female, young and old, throughout the known universe. While your fan base is limited to angry fat guys in basements. Yeah, but, but, uh, come on, fellas. I'm thrice the entertainer the rabbit is. <laughs> <laughs> Fine, he's hilarious, but moviegoers these days demand action heroes like me! Ha! Oh! Hee! Top that, rabbit! <laughs> so, it has come to this, has it? I'm afraid the Brothers Warner must choose between a handsome matinee idol or this miscreant perpetrator of low burlesque. Whichever one's not the duck. <laughs>